Hey, hey, and come back to me, all email. Uh, last time we defeat Yugi, and now we want to defeat the uh, challenge this Madawidan. I mean, I don't know if I can defeat Madawidan or not. <laughs> because it's so bad, actually. I mean, it's DC is most, more than 1,500. It's so big, actually. Because his deck is filled with the uh, uh, card that is so high in the attack, actually. For example, it's like a Meteor, Meteor B Dragon. Can you believe it was 3,500? 500 is in his deck yeah i recommend you to have a goblin fan goblin fan is something like uh, prevent you from the something a magic or magic card of a, or, or a trap card that is decrease your life point actually and it's same with the equip card such as ririoku ririoku is a disaster actually <laughs> if you see the ririoku uh, card that card dc is 99 you know is the most highest uh is the most highest dc actually even much more higher than the ultimate white dragon you know yeah this is bad actually because this leader is has uh, decreased the what the the enemy of them yeah a uh, Riroku is pain in the ass actually because once that card is equipped to the to his card uh his card is definitely so big actually because Ririoku is not gonna give him a uh, Ririoku uh, point is based on your life point actually so if you have a 400 uh, 4000 life point like me right now if the uh, if the enemy is using a uh, Ririoku uh, in his card or maybe in my card it will decrease my life point actually because it is Ryoko, not mine. So that's pretty bad actually. So I, I recommend you to have something like uh, you know, such a like a rare and temperate like this or maybe happy lover because this two card is uh, you know the net to neutralize the equip card so that's pretty good but I told you before right about why this uh this uh duelist has so mm, so big oh no the magic train but wait <laughs> okay it, it doesn't matter because i already have a zero star so that's not a fast yeah, that magic train is drain our uh, summoning star actually it, well right now i just have three star it, it can be see in the you know in the life point category and if you see that uh, that's why that's why why my hourglass of courage cannot be placed in the field because I just have three star right now and my August of courage is a uh, four star card. Uh, well mm, Zola mm, 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 this is bad this is bad <laughs> okay let's put it in here first I mean if you yeah, they definitely not. I don't know, but uh, you know, if you watch the anime of Yu-Gi-Oh in the Yu-Gi era, you know something like a uh, it's not a forbidden, but more like something like um, Egypt thing or something like that, or the Millennium item. Yeah, there are six Millennium item, right? And for example, it's like Yu-Gi have the pu a Millennium puzzle. Or maybe Pegasus has uh, or Pegasus has the Millennium Eye, and if you know that uh, the uh, if you know about that uh, Millennium thing effect, you know about the reason why uh, this duelist is not attacking my Air Knight Parsat with his Zoa because he know my Air Knight Parsat is much bigger because. Uh, if you see this Madawidan basically uh, uh, this Madawidan is basically uh, you know a creature that is summoned because the millennium item so it's like this uh, this duelist is like the the one who uh, how should I say like you know this millennium item is is needed to saggle the to saggle the some coffin or something like that and this million item is the 
I want the key of that. So that's why uh, this dwelleth has the, the six of the millennium item effect. So and one of the millennium items effect is a uh, known uh, know what is in the people's mind. Yeah, it was the millennium eyes effect. So that's why uh, he know that since my uh, Aaron Parshad is much more bigger than his Zoa, that's why Zo his Zoa is not even attacking me. And it's truly really effect actually in this game because if you choose the, I mean, if you met uh, the Pegasus uh, location, you know it's same actually because Pegasus it seems like he know about the card that is close. Even I mean like it's it's close, but Pegasus, but he it kind of like know about what is that card. So. I need to oh no 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 yeah I need to be patient actually <laughs> this is bad actually uh, I don't think this uh why do we don't mm, have something like a uh, house like that like uh, you know ritual card or something like that but the bad thing about this dwellist is he has a lot of trap actually yeah I told you about Yugi right Yugi has two mirror force and this dwellist has two <laughs> but I don't know how much but indeed he has so it kind of like carry scared me actually because and not just mirror mirror force actually he has something like a what is binding a gravity bind or something like that gravity bind is like the worst of the trap card actually I mean like I think that is the the highest card of something like uh, you know the trap card that decrease their uh, the card attack and defense actually I mean gravity bind is like the worst case because not only it decrease your card to the uh, 1000 oh okay whatever I mean you, you are so full huh you don't even know what is the hourglass of courage effect yeah hourglass of courage effect is you know, decrease our life point to the uh, 1000 life point and then give my all of my Pokemon attack and defense with the 1000 uh, point actually. So that's really big actually. And if you see my Air Knight Parsa right now, oh, it's 40, it's 4000, 4400. Can you believe that? Yeah, I still win, whatever. I mean, well, I'm not gonna lose, you know, even I still have, I just have such like one, a 600 life point like these. Okay, let's uh, make a mystical elf. The mystical elf is so big actually, I mean like, uh, if you know something like, uh, what is that card? I know about the card that is uh, 1,400 uh, 1, uh, attack. It was Winged Beast type that uh, summon Buku card. I mean, Buku card is not even shown up in the slot actually, but Mystical Elf is appear in the slot. So I think uh, it's kind. I don't know. I mean, a uh, Mystical Elf effect is much more useful than Buku or maybe a uh, Musa. Yeah, Musa is a fairy type actually. And it boosts the Musician King, the Spellcaster type. Oh wait, why? I think... Hmm, this is weird. I mean like, I told you about the... Uh, this well is know about my card, right? Then why you open my arena Parsha? Uh, no. Uh, Summoned... Summoned School is not the biggest spin card actually. The biggest card of Finn type is, I think Zera, right? Yeah, I think Zera is the most biggest card in this era. If I'm not, yeah, it's Zera. But indeed, the Summoner Skull is already good actually. Uh, the tricky part of the Summoner Skull card is their defense actually. Their attack can be, I mean, it can be, uh, I mean, the Summoned Skull attack is big, right? But their defense is pretty, pretty low, actually. So that's the weaknesses. 
Yeah, and Yugi has that card too. Oh, I'm so scared. I think... Uh, I think he doesn't have a Mirror Force right now. But my Mystical Elf is definitely cannot uh, attack him. Because I already... I just have 600, you know, 600 life point. I don't... Uh, I'm not supposed to be full or, you know, just trying or something like that. It can, it almost be win. Okay. Uh, let's uh, put in a different question. Yeah, I love actually something like a Ray and Temperate. Well, oh yeah. Talking about the Ray and Temperate and Happy Lover and Jirai Gomo as, Jirai Gomo as well. I think just that Pokemon. Uh, just that card actually. Mm. So what do you mean about that, huh? You want to defeat me? <laughs> so funny. Okay, let's talk about the last thing I want to talk about. Uh, you know, Jirai Gumo, Rain Temperate, and Happy Lover has the same effect actually. That card uh, neutralized the uh, equip card of of the uh, the equip card that is attached to the uh, the monster card actually. So with that card, your uh, so with that card, you definitely can turn uh, the card, the monster card, into their original uh, life point. But you know about the leader ability, right? For example, like my fairy type, my fairy type, uh, my fairy leader right now, my air knight Parshat, uh, has an ability to boost the fairy type. With a uh, fairy type card, uh, with just with five with five hundred point, so that's pretty good actually. But with that uh, happy lover, Jiragumo and Rain Temperate, it will not affect actually. They just neutralize neutralize the equip card, not the abilities leader. The leader ability. So yeah, uh, just that is, you know, a uh, lot. I just put uh, Hourglass of Life in there, and Hourglass of Life it has an effect too, actually, just like uh, Hourglass of Courage. But the difference is the Hourglass of Life is uh, decrease your life point to the to uh, one decrease your life point one hundred one thousand point, and uh, summoning random card in from the graveyard into your uh, field. It was random, so it, it can be the enemies card but it can be your any your card so it's pretty random but if the case like your life point is just like mine right now it's just like six a hundred life point the the hourglass of life effect is not working because my life point is a lower than the uh the task okay i win mm -hmm. well i'm hoping to get uh, I'm hoping my Arena Parshat get a uh, star. Oh, I get a rank. This is hard actually because I don't know. I I, I think I already uh, playing with my Arena Parshat pretty often, but I'm not even get um, how should I say? Like, I'm not even get uh, ranks up. Oh, I want to get Zoa, but well, whatever. I mean, this is a good thing actually because I didn't meet such a, like a, you know a trap card or something like that. I mean, I'm so uh, luck. I mean, my luck is in the rice right now. So this is the end of the water, eh, uh, the white rose chapter. But uh, don't worry. Uh, I mean, since we already defeat the m the boss of the this chapter, uh, it not means that it's over actually because we need we still need to uh, get the rose uh, uh, the red rose badge actually. So when this over, yeah. So when this over, uh, we just need to continue the progress and then we are in the 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 other side of the. Of the rose card uh, if you choose the white rose card just like me right now then the second uh, the second chapter is the red rose and so with the uh, the opposite one if you choose the red rose card as your first card 
it means that you uh, it means that you your second chapter is the white rose one you need to take notice uh, uh, code actually because this code is a code for the password actually but it's kind of same actually okay save it first and then yeah you to save it this progress you know if you don't save it it would uh, come back to the Madawidan battle look at this miss um, dancing elf I mean I don't know actually why this creator make a dancing elf as a T leader actually because T's favorite card is not dancing elf but it was a magician of faith well yeah indeed May Valentine or Kujakumai's uh, favorite card is Harpy Lady, so that's why. Uh, Kajiki Ryota is a water user, so whatever. And Honda, tada, Honda, and, uh, and Honda is a warrior uh, type of card, but he's not very good, uh, you know, into uh, this game, so that's why it's pretty easy to defeat. Jonochi is, yeah, Jonochi is favorite card. Well, I have a lot actually, and one of that is maybe this one. Uh, this yeah this flame uh, what is this card on <laughs> yeah, well, whatever oh you skipped shady yet yeah, uh the well i mean yeah maybe the exodia is the most good thing to replace about the yugi's grandfather bakura using a uh, lowest card actually in the enemy too but maybe why this a dark pen maybe because you know dark pen uh summoning the crush card right so it's more like a toxic thing so it's re it's a uh, match to his personality <laughs> well 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 you we know that yugi's favorite card is dark magician and his and dark magician girl is like the other side okay so that's for now thank you for watching and see you next time